Hey, this is Leo, and in this video I want to give you a quick demo of the LTC to MTC converter. This device allows you to take an incoming LTC audio signal, decode that, and convert that to an MTC signal that you can then send to another application or an external device. In this example, I'm going to use it to synchronize the playback in Logic Pro to the playback in Ableton Live. But of course you can also do this with Pro Tools, for example, or you can use it to send the MTC signal to an external device like a light desk and uh, synchronize that to the playback in Ableton Live. My setup is fairly simple. I have a session here in Live with a song and an LTC timecode track. And then on the Logic side of things, I just have a session with a video clip in here. Um, maybe I want to do the Foley work in Logic and work on the song in Ableton Live. So to synchronize the two, uh, all I have to do is to take the LTC to MTC converter, drag it onto the LTC timecode track, and then on the logic side of things, I just have to go to the project settings, synchronization, and set the sync mode to MTC. And with that done, the playback is now synced. So if I go to the intro here, for example, and press play, You can see that Logic Pro syncs to the playback in live. I can do the same thing if I want to jump to a specific part, for example. And that's basically it. If you want to send the MTC signal to another device, you can select that here. By default, the LTC to MTC converter sets up its own virtual MIDI device. So you don't have to take care of setting up an IIC device just for that. But um, yeah, if you want to send the MTC signal to another device, um, you can just select it here and you're good to go. And that's it. If you have any further questions, feel free to let me know in the comments and I wish you a great day.